Okay, so I fixed a uh, dude's um, creepy stalker stuff. So he had put homeless equals zero, Mary equals zero. No, homeless equals one, Mary equals zero. The truth will prevail. I fixed it to <laughs> dollar sign homeless equal $1,000 universal basic income UBI, Mary equals 007. And then I added um, Satya, which is like truth, but it's also my Buddhist anti-money uh, guy down in, from Food Not Bombs down in Portland, and then anti-capitalist. So I did buy nothing day. Somebody crossed off nothing and put buy everything day, but you can, woman, okay. And then somebody was here, was there, and that said, woman like freedom, and that's for the women in Iran and Freegan. And this is just to kind of get it started. And also, I kind of felt upset that Corey Quinn's misogyny saying Mary equals zero would be a really negative message for young women. And that's actually a thought that I had when he was getting verbally abusive with me when I confronted him about his hand on my throat, is that, oh, I'm so glad you don't have a female child because you don't know how to respect women. Oh, there's cool beans. That's cool. So, um, uh, and also Brenda was saying, well, maybe I should go Mary equals Oompa Loompa which maybe I could change that. And I'm like, Mary's just a pointless name. I really hate that name. Anyone who knows me knows I don't like that name. So that's already kind of irritating me. But Woman Life Freedom is for the women in Iran. Yeah, it's looking good. And I think we're making lemonade out of it. And I even saw people taking pictures of his stuff. So um, yeah, it was a great hearing. He admitted to caressing my neck, which is kind of different than what he did. He put his hand around my throat and held it there freaking me out like he's a serial killer but um i'm not dead obviously so i survived and when he put his naked micro venus that was flaccid in my face and then towards my vagina it never penetrated but he lied to the judge and that's why he had to invoke the truth is because after perjuring himself in judge mcintosh's court bragging about having sexual intercourse with me multiple times which was definitely not true it was <laughs> like for one thing, I had no condoms of a snugger fit variety size. Did not plan to sleep with him ever, especially when I saw what he had going on. Poor, poor thing. Poor Corey Quinn. It's hard being a six foot one guy with a micro penis, I know.